Hi guys, today I wanted to go over the pretty simple process uh, and that is calculating nitrogen balance. Um, nitrogen balance as we know is uh, nitrogen that you take in minus the nitrogen that you put out and that's going to equal your nitrogen balance. So first let's talk about nitrogen in. Nitrogen in is basically your dietary protein intake But uh, that's protein. We have to convert the protein into nitrogen. And 16% of the weight of that protein is nitrogen. Uh, so a couple different ways you can do the calculation for nitrogen in. Um, the way that I learned it uh, is basically you're going to take your dietary protein in. So you take your protein and you divide it by 6.25 and actually 6.25 when you divide that it's the same thing as multiplying by 16 percent uh, so you can actually do it either way multiply the protein that you take in by 16 percent or divide it by 6.25 you will get the same answer uh, next let's look at nitrogen out nitrogen out is determined by a uh, lab, you do a 24-hour urinary collection, and then they'll analyze the urine and determine how much nitrogen came out, and that's called urinary urea nitrogen, or UUN, okay? Uh, and that'll be a lab value, and you'll get a number back, and uh, that's just part of the story because we also have to account for nitrogen that's lost through other routes, uh, such as nitrogen that's lost in the feces, nitrogen that's lost in skin and sweat. Uh, and that is estimated to be uh, a, a, a constant 4 grams uh, per day. All right. So if we just do our substitution here uh, for nitrogen balance, we can get our uh, answer. So let me give you an example. Let's say that we've done a uh, calorie count on a person and turns out that uh, they're eating about 85 calories, I'm sorry, 85 grams of protein a day. Protein. And uh, the same person, they've done a 24-hour urinary urea nitrogen collection, and their UUN is 12 grams per day. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to first determine our nitrogen in, and nitrogen in is going to be 85 divided by 6.25, and that 85 divided by 6.25 comes out to be 13.6 grams of nitrogen going in. Now our nitrogen coming out is going to be 12 grams plus the 4 grams that are constant. So we have 16 grams going out. So if we look at the nitrogen balance for this individual, we have 13.6 minus 16. So the nitrogen balance is going to be a minus 2.4 grams. And all these units are grams. So this person is losing or using more nitrogen, or more protein, than they're taking in. So they're in negative nitrogen balance, uh, which is not a good place to be. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.